not going to let her get away with this. Emily, don't start anything. She's the one who started it. Ready? Do you even know what your mother has done? Or do I have to be the one to tell you? Huh? You want me to tell you? Haven't you already done enough? I mean it. You stay away from my daughter. Hey, I don't know. So Emily, why you don't want, want to do this? Oh, don't I? No, you're coming with me. Let's go. You don't want to do this. Trust me. Marty, what are you doing with Emily's hand? Don't worry. It's, it's kind of complicated. I'll, I'll tell you later. I've just got to go check on Emily and make uh, sure she's okay. Mother, get down, calm down. Oh my, are you all right? Okay, now what's going on? Who, who knows what's going on when it comes to Marty's baby? No, truly, I have no idea. What's going on? Emily, Emily, you did the right thing. Then, when I was like four and I didn't play with matches. No, when you were like 20 and you didn't play with fire, you were right not to get into it with Dorian. Well, I didn't kick it out. Listen to me. You did the right thing. Trust me. You don't want to get between Dorian and Cassie. You know what they say about a bear in a tub? Oh, I don't know. I just thought like her daughter deserved to know what she did. Well, maybe so, but Cassie is pregnant and she can't handle that right now. God, how long she's got. Oh, no, I don't care. Marty, you're right. I just would have just... Root it up. Well, I guess I should start packing. They evict me from the dorm. But they're not going to evict you. Yes, they are. It's a package deal. You get expelled, you get evicted. And what I did to General Carpenter. Oh. Marty, I thought my junior year was going to be so cool, and I just wrecked everything. Stop thinking like that. No, I'm not. It's true. Look, a year ago, I was doing some pretty messed up things. I was drinking, I was lying to everyone, I was hurting everyone, especially myself. That's true. Remember now, you really screwed up. So you see, I mean, I thought it was all over for me, but I pulled out of it to get friends people like you. Maybe now, but not then. Believe me. Uh -huh. Not then. Emily, people are nicer than you think. Most of them will give you a second chance. Hey. Nobody burns me up. I'm the one whose name is going to be Mud. I am the one who everybody's going to blame. Only I wasn't the only one. I mean, Dorian Lord should have to pay, too. Why is it that she gets off scot free? He <sighs> led you astray. But he's changed. He's found the Lord, and the Lord has given him strength and a new hope. I don't mean to insult you, but aren't you being a little too trusting here? I don't think so. Listen to me. God can be charming when he wants to, and he can lie like a rug, but that doesn't mean he's been saved. If you don't believe me, then go talk to Marty Saber and see what she has to say about Todd Manning. Okay, I'll, um, I'll head over to Rhodes later, and we can figure out something, okay? Huh? Yeah. <laughs> I've met him a couple of times. He is so cute. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Todd, huh? Yeah. You didn't catch me turning down a date with him. I wasn't turning down a date. I just thought maybe we could do something else. Mm, I couldn't do that either. I couldn't even. <laughs> uh, you're not like that. You don't know. What do you mean I don't know? Emily! What? What do you mean? I don't know. Nothing. I just don't know if I'm putting you down or anything. I just, you know, I, I can tell you're not afraid. I'm not? I, I just mean that you can tell that like, you don't like this, you don't like that. They just keep coming back for more. Me, they just shrug and walk away. <laughs> you're afraid a guy won't like you if you speak up? Guys? 
people, my parents, you name it. <laughs> That's the way it was with Claudia, um, the landlord. I was like that with her too. I just, I just wanted her to like me so bad. It's you. You have got it made. You got everything. Let me tell you something. When my parents thought I was seven years old, I didn't have anybody. Oh, except of course my aunt Kiki. She could possibly have loved me less, but I doubt it. <laughs> um, what I'm trying to say is, I grew up thinking like you did that if I could, you know, please this person or please that person, I know they'd like me. But it never worked. So mm. I decided, well, wait a minute. This is my life, and if if a person wants to like me for me, if a person wants to share, fine. If not, then buzz off. Wow. <laughs> that the way it is at the end say, when you say? Yeah, we, we do a lot together. Mm. <laughs> he is so great. <laughs> is that? About that walk, Emily, uh, still want to go? Right, I'm gonna go fix my makeup. I look very silly. Hello? Mm, hey, hi, it's Marty. Huh? Hey, I'm so glad you called. Yeah, I, you know, I just wanted to see if things were okay after what happened at lunch. I'm, I am sorry if I seem rude. No, no, not at all. Everything's fine. Yeah, it, it's okay? My mother explained everything to me. She did? Yeah. Once she told me, and I understood that she was the one who forced Emily to come clean. I understood why Emily was so off the wall today. You still there? Yeah, I'm here. My mother's been going through a really rough time lately. Yeah, I, I guess. In fact, um, we're going to go away for a couple of days. Oh. Huh, just you and Mom, huh? Um, when are you going? Well, you know, my mother, just as soon as I come back, but first, I want to run over to Sloan and tell myself how happy I am this whole nightmare is over. <laughs> oh, yes. 